why are you the way you are? That's your phrenesis. What made Solomon so great? The Bible says God gave to Solomon phronesis. He gave him more phronesis than all the world. Nobody was as wise. And the kind of wisdom that he gave to him was phronesis. When you're born again, Christ is your Sophia. You understand? He's your wisdom. And that wisdom is general wisdom. It is the wisdom of God in its entirety that's imparted to you. But then, can you walk in it? How can you walk in that wisdom? It's not practical. It's theoretical wisdom. Then he gives you his word. You start studying the scriptures. As you study the scriptures, you form an understanding. That understanding is called sunesis. It is your reasoning. That is the wisdom. That wisdom is called sunesis. It's your reasoning. Then, when it is seasoned, when your reasoning becomes seasoned, it gives you phronesis, a mindset. That's why Paul said that you may understand my sunesis in the mystery of Christ. He's talking about his reasoning, his gospel, his understanding. Why does he think like this? God says there is a phronesis of the just. A phronesis of the righteous. They have a way of thinking. Everybody doesn't think that way. There is a way. There's a way of reasoning that is reserved for the righteous. Like there was a name that was reserved for the righteous to live by. That name is called Jesus. He kept it. And when there was one that became obedient even unto death, he gave unto him a name that is above every name. That at the name of Jesus, every knee should bow. Why? Because he was obedient even unto death. Now he's telling the disobedient, I want to take you from that arena of failure to the wisdom, the phronesis of the righteous. The Bible says that one by his obedience, made many righteous. There's a wisdom reserved just for us. So he brings us into that wisdom. That is the seventh dimension. Where you function at God's level. Oh my goodness. You see life from a higher point. You find yourself walking at the very top of the mountain. You can see everything from there, from the mountain of God. You see, we sing it all the time. Is Mount Zion the size of a north, the city of the great king? That's where it is, Mount Zion. When you're there, oh, oh. You know exactly what to say. Uh, let me explain it. Phronesis, phronesis is that wisdom that controls your actions, your thoughts, your words. You just say the right thing. You just do the right thing. You just think the right thoughts. And people can understand why your life is so excellent. Queen of Sheba was so smart, so intelligent. She was well-schooled, well-educated. But when she came, to Solomon, she said the half of it was not told me. She was shocked at the wisdom of the man Solomon. It was not the school. It was that night when he prayed to God when God showed up in his room and said, What do you want? He said, Give me wisdom. God said, I have given you, I have, by his word, I have, hi, 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 hi. Ah! 
He didn't open his head to put anything inside. He didn't have to do anything. He said, I have given you wisdom. If you enjoyed this message and want to partner with us, or for information and other ministry resource materials that are available, please visit our website at www.pastorchrispodcast.com. Also send your testimonies or other feedback to podcast at christembassy.net. Thank you for joining us. God bless you.